Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name is Ken. Today's experiment is the straw propeller air motor. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is two straws, tape, a ruler, scissors, and adult supervision. To set up this experiment, you need two straws. One I cut at a four inch length. Um, and so once you get that, you're gonna fold it in half, uh, which uh, if I have to do the simple math for you, that's two inches. Once you get that folded in half there, you're going to just cut off the corners of each one just like this. Uh, so get a pair of scissors and just cut a little nick each. You see the, the blue lines there, I kind of just went right to the blue lines. A little bit more on this corner here. And then you're set, you open it up and you can see you have a hole in the straw right there, kind of like a little diamond shape. Um, once you get that done, then you're going to take a couple pieces of tape. I took blue electrical tape. It could be any kind of tape. And you're going to pinch down the end and put the tape over the ends um, and hold it pinched down so uh, the air can't get out and seal that tightly. doesn't matter if it goes over the extra uh, to the side because we will trim that. Uh, then do the same thing on the other end uh, where you take the tape, push down very hard so it's squeezed. And now we're going to... Uh, cut off the excess tape on the straw. Um, you don't want to cut the straw itself yet. You just want to get the tape itself cut off. So just go ahead and trim that tape off there. And once you get all four corners of the tape trimmed, then we are going to, little, little problems there. There we go. Make sure the tape's secure. And then we're going to cut off um, uh, two different ends here of the straw. So we'll take the end of the straw here and just cut a tad off. We just want a little bit of the hole opening just like this. It doesn't have to be a large, just enough for the air to get out. And then we're going to do the opposite end to the bottom down here uh, where we did the top and the other one. Same cut. Um, so now we got to cut a little hole on each side but opposite ends. So one's facing up and one's facing down. That piece is done. Now we're going to take um, a second straw, but we're not cutting it in half. We just want to cut a little dentation out of it, um, about an inch and a half down off this. We're, we're just trying to cut a little groove out of the straw here so the other straw can rest into that little niche there. So about halfway down, um, a little, just the same size as the straw. And then you're going to take the other straw and slide it in see how it fits right like that so you might have to go back and cut it a little bit but you want the other straw to fit right into that niche right there now we're going to do the same thing we did on the sides we're going to put tape on the top piece so we're going to go ahead and take a piece of tape and pinch down on the straw and fold it back over the top and press down so it seals it off and then we're going to cut off the excess tape there um, on the straw so it's just flush with the straw right there this time we are not not going to cut anything out you can see it spins around but it's a little little tight uh, what I did here is I added a little blue line so you can see the propeller spinning around you can use different colors um, it'll kind of give it a nice little effect so and here's a side look on it so when you put your mouth on it and you blow um, here I'm just pl playing around with it showing it it does spin not very good now, when you blow on it, you have an air propeller, right? Air propeller engine right there. So it's blown away. The faster you blow, the faster the propeller goes. So this is a real easy and fun experiment to set up. And uh, the kids really love doing it, um, especially if you start doing a little bit of design on your propeller. Like I have blue, you can get really uh, tricky and start doing a lot of different colors on there. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to click thumbs up and to subscribe as we do a new video every day. Thanks for watching.